in you. You'll see when you go anywhere and there's wild animals. An uh, animal that's been habituated by food will come to you, you can't hurt them. Do you notice the redheads? Yeah, they're nice. Have you seen the redheads? Very, very good. It's a red ass, not a redhead. Now, a new one has mutated and developed and the I came for a complete different reason. I came to do consulting work on game farm, for game farms. There's a lot of people buying farms. And then I get the rhythm beside the body and I find another one. So I was trying to remove sitting in the front, and the fourth one is from one, two, three, there's three of them. Born the 10th of November last year. They got their territory and they stick with that. What about the male, like the male that they're going to send out? Would it just I think the human factor that, that meerkats stand on their hind legs like humans, anything that's humanized by either the way they move, the way they, they, their personalities are. Monkeys, for instance, are very popular because people can relate to babies and they put nappies on. With meerkats, it's the fact that they can stand up. The, 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 Afrikaans and German name for them are Erdmenschen or Erdmanne, which means earth people. And that is what makes them so attractive, is the fact that they are kind of human. But in that, you are designed perfectly. You hear that, Adam? Wow, that's human population and if they go on the main road and one of our native farm workers find them this is a delicacy for them they eat them really yeah mm -hmm. is this her palace again sorry is this her palace? Uh, we got to watch the uh, mercats wake up in the morning and welcome us to the sunshine and come out of their burrows and we learned about um, that they're family animals and they stick together, hunt together and sleep together. Well, I enjoyed it. It was a great way to get up and start the day and it's, uh, it's cool out here this morning. Uh, the naturalist, Devies, was very informative, especially about their life cycle, their breeding habits, uh, how they're, they're, they're bonding as a family and how they stick together and look for each other, uh, look after each other. Uh, it was quite educational and uh, informative and, and entertaining too. They put on a little show for us. It was very nice. Don't get 2,000 rand for his food towards his lodging. We've got to kill him this week. And people don't like mm -hmm. uh, I don't. That's. Born the 30th of January. Um, the. Okay, we just move in front of you because I. Okay, I can see the. 